Beautiful music should happen in a beautiful place. We see the fine arts as an opportunity to help students explore a, a, a less verbal world than we do in the rest of our subjects. Virtually every student on this campus uh, will enter this building in the course of a year for some reason or another, uh, either to see a performance uh, or to see an exhibition uh, or to talk with friends or simply to come into the atrium uh, or to find one of the corners of the building and study or read or work on a computer. In any building dedicated to music, the concert hall is the heart. Uh, and, and of course that concert hall has to be highly functional. It is, I think, the most highly designed, uh, most carefully studied, uh, most scientifically monitored space in a music building. Well, every person who has walked into this space when I've been present has been awed by how beautiful it is. And then I think equally inspired by the sound. just over 300 seats. Um, for a hall that will house a, a symphony orchestra on occasion, that's, that's a small space. So we want to build buildings with spaces where large groups can gather, and that's true of the atrium. And we want to create spaces where small groups can gather, or where individuals can simply be and not be isolated in a dormitory room. Uh, can simply be alone, but in a social space. That space is alive with students um, from early morning until very late at night. Prior to this project, we had neither the, the capacity nor the history uh, of, of storing and displaying art. We simply couldn't do it. So we have visiting artists showing their work on campus at a level that simply did not exist before. Those two large rehearsal rooms are big boxes, uh, meant to be as flexible as possible. The arts are for everybody, and so let's make these spaces visible from the outside. One of the geniuses of the design of this building is the extent to which it brings in natural light and yet manages to be responsible and sustainable. I think people feel connected to the arts in ways that they never had an opportunity to before. This is a beautiful place to be, uh, and, and I believe very strongly that architecture affects behavior, uh, and beauty affects behavior. People want to be in beautiful places, uh, and the beauty of the concert hall, uh, the beauty of the atrium space uh, acts like a magnet uh, for people on the campus who, who want to spend some time in a space that is attractive and inspiring.